Good evening and welcome to the Thai PBS World. Tomorrow, protester has arranged to have a major rally at the Democracy Monument as they announced. But today before tomorrow, it turned out to be quite chaotic at the site as the police officer has arrested 21 activists. Just one day before a major anti-government rally, police this afternoon arrested 21 political activists during a swoop on a demonstration at the Democracy Monument. There was a chaotic scene as policemen dragged one of the activists, Jatupat Bunpatra Raksa, from the top of a pickup truck and bundled him into a waiting police van as dozens of demonstrators streamed in protest. Jatupat is better known as Pai Daudin, who has been staging intermittent anti-government activities since the military coup in 2014. Twenty others were also taken into custody and immediately brought to the headquarters of Region 1 Border Patrol Police at Kong Luang, Batum Thani. Deputy Police Spokesman, Police Colonel Grisana Patana Jaran, said the activists were charged with organizing unauthorized public gathering and other minor offenses, including obstruction of traffic and unauthorized use of loudspeakers. During the scuffle at the rally site at the Democracy Monument, demonstrators threw hands at the policemen to try to stop them from arresting the activists. The arrest prompted dozens of members of the so-called Ratsadon group, led by student activist Parit Chiwarak, to rally in front of the headquarters of the National Police in Pratum 1 to demand an immediate release of the activists. Police said the confrontation today was sparked by the demonstrators' refusal to move away from the road to clear the way for a royal motorcade on its way to the temple of the Emerald Buddha. Buddha. Parit, who is better known as Penguin, said the arrest would further fuel public resentment toward the Prayut government and call for a massive turnout for tomorrow's rally at the Democracy Monument. At the time of our reporting, the 21 activists are still being held in police custody. The so-called Rasadon group styled itself after a group of military men and civilians who led a revolution that in Thailand's absolute monarchy in 1932. It hopes to use tomorrow's rally to pressure Prime Minister Prayut Chan O Sha to resign and for a new constitutional to be adopted. The group also wants to press ahead with its demand for a sweeping reform of the monarchy. Meanwhile, Suthep Thuksuban, who led the months-long street protest against the Yinglak government that triggered the military coup in 2014, said today he will mobilize people to show on Ratchadamnern Avenue to greet the motorcade of His, His Majesty the King. In his Facebook post, Suthep, who is the former leader of the People's Democratic Reform Committee, or PDRC, urged his supporters to turn up in yellow at Mahajesadabodin Pavilion to welcome His Majesty the King's motorcade and to remain there.